welcome everyone to our first Bite Size Series webinar. Uh, the topic today is FFT Fundamentals. So um, the contents of what we're going to be talking about today, um, we're going to start off with uh, the time frequency relationship and um, why it's useful to understand this. Uh, then we're going to go into the fast Fourier transform itself um, and the differences between different kinds of Fourier transform. z-axis which you marked as frequency. If you then plot your individual waves according to their frequency you get something similar to this uh, graph here. And if we then rotated our view so that we looked into the frequency axis you'd get something uh, similar to what we've got on screen now which if you're 250,000 uh, FFT points the DFT is taking just under 69 billion uh, calculations whereas the FFT takes about 1.4 million calculations so you can see there's a pretty big difference in the amount of time it's um, it's a lot faster and it's a lot higher resolution than what you would usually do um, in a conventional uh, swept frequency response and uh, you can see now how fast it updates because I'm tweaking this EQ in real time so the bin centers frequency response is a very good technique if you've got something so what we do to get around this um, is we effectively repeat the data before and after our actual um, sample window to simulate having uh, real data there. But this, uh, this can lead to a discontinuity. We can visually identify um, distortion in the time domain. Well, the answer actually is none of the above, and we'll see why now if I just take that off. So this sine wave here, if um, if you look at that in the time domain, you can't really see anything wrong with it, but if you kind of scale for what you'd be looking at your whole spectrum, you wouldn't be able to notice this at all. And so it's it's very hard to get an accurate um, measurement by looking just at your amplitude. Yes, so it, it automatically adjusts slightly the filters to account for these effects to, gi to give you um, repeatable uh, and accurate measurement, which is actually very easy to uh, undertake. <laughs> 